Rivals of Aether between the Northern Island Wellington region and the Southern Island Christchurch region. And uh, yeah, we've got uh, four players aside. Four players aside, three stocks each. Let's see who comes out on top. Yeah, I'm really fucking excited. Um, apparently, uh, Sky possibly being the, the sort of contender, like Christchurch's biggest threat, but by the sounds of it, your sort of top three area is quite contested. I would say so. Ash has been, of course, uh, in the Auckland region for the summer, but uh, when we were ranking those tournaments, he was definitely, uh, he was definitely up there, and oh, he's right. probably going to be up there when he comes back. And I mean, if there's a region to like sort of keep your uh, rivals chops going, and Auckland's definitely a good one with like Jarcino uh, up there and Fell, of course. Um, you know, it's definitely a place that you could go to skill up for a, for a little while. Yeah, Auckland's definitely got the strongest players mm. right now. Um, but Jarcino, unfortunately, not at this event, but Fell is going to be in the bracket. Yeah, so. he's not here today, uh, I don't think, but uh, I mean, man. yeah, the rivals bracket comes in tomorrow. Um, that's for, for singles, of course, and um, no, it should be tight. That's a ooh, camera, some, some camera sorting. Got some excellent soundtrack going right now. Yeah. Oh, rival soundtrack, always great. That's it. Oh, that's not bad. Hold yeah. on. All good. You bring it? It's, it's like the best part of my face anyway. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're all good, side. So. Oh, true. But yeah, um, it's going to be super exciting, I think. Uh, I personally have no idea who's the favorite uh, side going into this, or uh, or anything like that, but yeah, I, I'm a player on the Crashers team, so of course I have to say Crashers is going to win. But uh, in truth, this is a very, I think this will be quite heated. Yeah, this will be a good battle. And the whole crowd's here, you know, everyone's hyped. Uh, let's see. Hopefully, Ash redeems himself from the Wellington Christchurch ulti oh, we or from talk, Biggie too. We don't talk about that. Hey, but if it if he comes out on top and kicks. Uh, uh, he gets the advantage for us early exactly. on. Exactly, like, different. yeah, it's ju it just makes it a better story in the end, doesn't it? You bet. Ash rocking his trademark Shovel Knight. He's mm. been flip-flopping on some characters, as we all have. This is early New Zealand meta. Totally. Um, but he's going for his tried and true character. I think it's really nice to see people exploring the, the roster and not settling down too quick. But, game one. <laughs> Let's get yeah. this started. Yeah. ICK versus Ash. Ash has a lot of experience in the Craig matchup. Oh, I bet. Can ICK really bring the heat here? Mm. Shovel wow. Knight, not an uncommon character in Wellington either. Totally. Yeah, and I mean, like, who doesn't have Craig experience at this point with the amount of uh, online tournaments and Craig being a notorious uh, sort of online demon, for sure. Oh, he is. ICK probably getting plenty of great experience online. Yeah. But uh, I would say, like, pretty even at the beginning of this game, you know. Ash has got some nice little strings going yeah, on. ICK has got some really good zoning to start off, but, um, yeah. Um, really Ash good recovery. By stuffing a lot of his options. Wow! Perfect catch with the up smash. First stock, and it's for Wellington. Yeah. I was just going to say, I think um, I think recovering in this matchup is, is mainly like where this is going to be decided and how people can mix it up off the day. It can be very brutal. Yeah. Good armor through the side B. Ooh. Oh, nice parry. And, and Ash takes this yeah. stuff. He gets the upgrade. Which one did he get? Oh, ICK tries to interrupt the recovery. Mm. Really good use of back air I'm noticing for ICK. Not a move I see a lot of crags I feel use that often. Wow. Forward air, bit of a notorious killer. Oh, it is, Craig. It's a classic move, the drop kick. But it always catches you off guard when it kills like that, eh? Now, ICK's definitely got the advantage, but I've seen Ash bring this out. Oh, I totally. Need to bring out a sick combo, as we saw against Fell at DNL. Yeah. And I mean, yeah, and Shovel Knight's got the potential, eh? Like, I feel like sometimes you get touched by that character and you just lose your stock and there was nothing you could do about it. It certainly feels that way. He's mm. got some amazing tech chase coverage. Yeah. Uh, really nice character. I, I mean, nice I, I, I grow to appreciate every character in this game. Yeah. To be wow. Fantastic catch with that up smash, but he doesn't quite finish it, but Ash kind of on the ropes here. Ash really wants the stock. Yeah. Oh, no. Here. Good wow, DI. nice DI. Oh, nice K gets that. Yeah, fantastic coverage with the up smash from ICK, I think, through that whole match. Um, but hopefully, I mean, as we said, Christchurch has some killers on the like, upper echelon.
Ooh. A little bit of deliberation between the Christchurch team on who's going in next. Um, I'm sure it's always hard to uh, sort of make that decision. Uh, I think, yeah, I think a lot of the time you could say that a crew battle was definitely won or lost in uh, in your your player selection, you know, in the ordering that you decide to match people up in. But uh, who does Cheese play in this game? I heard Cheese. He's got Eliana. Ooh, big Eliana fan here. Yeah, really. That, that I think. I wish I was smart enough to be an Eliana like me, you know? <laughs> but when she first came out, I played the hell out of her, and I would win a lot because people didn't know what she did. But uh, but now I think like people are very wise to her shenanigans, and uh, she's, I think she's very scary, and uh, like when, when someone really knows how to play her, like it's very easy to see. Okay, so Charlie's putting in the Konami code to unlock his uh, favorite skin. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, just casual. There we are. I think I think that's crucial. Bit of the mental, the mental help. Yeah, he just feels comfortable seeing a rabbit on screen instead of a snake. I don't blame him. I mean, I know I feel uncomfortable when I don't get to play my arcade maple. You know, it's my favorite skin by far. Oh, uh, yeah, or the skins rabbit. are a big part of rivals' culture. Mm, right? Totally, totally. I think you can tell a lot of uh, about people by like what colors they use. True. Uh, and if they've got some whack custom color. Oh. Those are banned at Biggie, right? Custom colors? Yeah. I would assume so. Oh. If this was some sort of legitimate tournament, I would hope so. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, ironic. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right. I actually haven't seen this Eliana. Yet. So, ICK versus Cheese. Uh -huh. Cheese has only got two spots to take. Yep. Starts off with a nice rock throw. Yeah, I think though that Eliana is one of those characters that, with momentum, uh, this could be like, this could be really hard for ICK. Wow, lucky to make it back there. Um, but yeah, I think Eliana is super momentum based, and uh, I think we're seeing it here. Like, ICK yeah. getting a good string, but like still on the back foot. All right, ICK getting a hit or two though. Mm. It's not quite a stock. Yeah. And because of how heavy Eliana is and how good her recovery is, uh, oh, and she ooh, nice that job. It can be one of those characters that you just feel like you can't get rid of. All right, and she's the, the grenade. This could be really bad for He's ICK. He's got a setup planned if he wants Christchurch to stay alive in this crew yeah. battle. No. What has he got? Full heated. Full ooh. heated. Turning ooh. it up. That was almost amazing from Cheese, but oh, still edge guarding. Oh, oh, he needed that overheat. Good DI. So heavy. Nice parry though from ICK. Finally, good, ICK good, good. Now taking four stocks off of Crestage. Yeah. And like he's got to be hopeful if he's wanting to get another one here. He's got to turn it up because he's definitely been on the back foot to cheese on this one. Ooh. Really nice movement for Cheese. Wow. Oh, no way. Fantastic. What a reversal. Game. Abusing the heftiness of Eliana. Good string. Alright. Cheese needs to clean this up. Yeah, and fantastic has. finish. Yeah. Cheese definitely struggling to find the kill on that last bit. He did, unfortunately, one bad uh, defensive position, mm. and ICK just stole that stock. Yeah, I feel like Eliana can definitely be a character that struggles and disadvantage a little bit. Can get a little overwhelmed. Yeah, definitely a floaty. Also, <laughs> she plays like a floaty, but she gets comboed like a heavy. Sort of the worst of both worlds. Some excellent setups, uh, mm. but definitely a hard character to play. Totally. Definitely Cheese, like, already, I'm just seeing, like, uh, I'm really interested in how he like develops with this character if he continues to stick with her because I think Eliana's the type of character that like has a high skill floor but has like a really high skill ceiling and uh, I mean it's a good start, you know? Definitely showcasing what his character can do before the bracket even begins. Totally, yeah. I think if anyone didn't think he was a threat because of his character before, they can definitely look at him now and go, Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> this guy's scary. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people have played people's uh, like secondary Eliana, and they're like, haha, I know what to do, and they shoot all the rockets and stuff. And people are like, yeah, you just parry. But uh, I think he's showing off here, like, 
this is how Eliana is played. And like, um, he's not here to just have a good time. He's yeah. going to make sure they have a bad time. He's out, he's out here to do business. So Swanchi, I would mm. say a good thing. Yeah. I think this would definitely be an interesting matchup. And like we said, uh, Eliana sort of uh, gets hit like a heavy. And I think uh, Abs are definitely in a position to abuse that. So Christ is still at that two-stop deficit. Mm. Yeah, Cheese definitely hoping to at least get one here. Yeah, Cheese would want to take at least two. Yeah, from, that'd uh, be Swanchi. really good. To see if Chrysler has a real chance of like staying in it. And it begins. <laughs> that Swanji's classic. starting up with the classic Alps of Ipto. <laughs> yeah. That classic forward killed off go for <laughs> the Absa player. Interesting, the Absa up he goes through the steam. Yeah. I think people learned that like you can roll through it uh, and, and air dodge through it. There's uh, ways to deal with it. Yeah. Because yeah. a lot of people can get really caught out by that. Nice parry from Cheese. Oh, he's getting some real damage now. Good damage. And he's still in the mix. Ups are quite light. Ooh. I wouldn't be surprised if something could happen. Yeah, I think Cheese is sort of going for those, uh, is it up tilt with the claw a little too much? And Swanji's punishing him for that, but overheated now. Ooh, that's He's the bail. Good landing. Nice coverage on the landing. Ooh, that's it. Ooh. And that makes it hard for Christchurch. Like I said, uh, Swanji sort of being. Ooh. All right. We got a. Uh, got IDK Sorry, folks, I'm going to pass the comms over to Cheese. No. Best of luck to you. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, this makes it really hard for Christchurch, and I know that uh, they were definitely hoping for Cheese to at least take one stop there, but um, hey man, you get put in the situation you're in, and when you when you lose that first game, uh, and you're you're the one that's down, you're constantly being counterpicked, and so Wellington got the ability to put in the opposite here, because they thought it would be the, uh, you know, the correct choice. Good day, Cheese. Hello. Good showing on the Eliana. I'm impressed. I haven't seen an Eliana move like that. Uh, <laughs> not from this country, at least. Well, thank you. Yeah. Could have done better, but it is what it is. No, Let's go totally. Christchurch. Let's go Christchurch? Yeah. Hey, we all like to see a comeback. And I mean, uh, from what I understand, Hamish Sky is definitely sort of like your upper two. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. So I think uh, be done. Ash was actually second on the PR on the first PR, but yeah. That was earlier in the season. I think Sky would have probably been first even. Yeah, I think Hamish was saying that like uh, by the time the PR out, Sky hadn't really popped off. But now it's sort of yeah. like him and Sky yeah. sort of fighting. And Ash has been away in Auckland. Yeah, so. um, but no, uh, I thought uh, some of your fucking your sort of schmixes there and your Thank combos you. were super sweet as uh, Eliana. I've never really seen. Uh, I think everyone's sort of like got their mate that's like, oh yeah, I've got an Eliana like pocket, <laughs> and all they do is shoot the rockets and the fists and shit like that. Uh, you got you got to get the mines in there. Oh totally. I think I think the mines is like how you know if an Eliana knows what they're doing because yeah. it, it is kind of hard to get the mine on someone when you when you don't know what you're doing. It's pretty much the optimal parry punish is always put a mine on. Mm. Oh true, because it wouldn't break them out of parry, right? And then you can sort of yeah. get them after. And uh, depending on how strong the move was that you parried, you can sometimes. Uh, land a mine and then up tilt and then follow them up to the corner and just blow the mine up and they just they get very good. Nasty. Now, what aim, what experience here does Amos have with uh, against an Absa? Um, to be honest, all of us in Christchurch has very limited Absa um, experience, but uh, we, we've got Gamma Fox. I don't know if um, Amos has played against him. Right. I think I think it takes a very particular person to be an Absa player. You know what I mean? Wow. Super nice, nice string. Yeah. And Swanji's always all. Hamish looking to do the same. Uh, Absa will die pretty early here to Craig's thing. Totally. He's like what? Top three uh, lighters? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, Big Wellington yeah. chance on the crowd. They're having to see what they're seeing. He used to get more of this rock play in there. Yeah. I think. Yeah, he sort of feels snuffed out. And like, even picking up the rock gives Absa time to set up. Hey. Right. Ooh. And that's it. There yeah. it is. The classic Craig there. Scary as hell. So hard to DI those strikes. Yeah. You hold in, you just get feared again, you just get feared again, you die. Ooh, nice pressure from Swanji on the ledge. On this stage, you can probably fairly safely hold out on the first couple. Mm. I don't think it, it's not the smallest stage. Yeah, no, I agree. But uh, taking good control of the center stage, you see Ooh. there, Alps have already died. Well, Almost. nearly died. I think. Wow. There's another up here. Yeah. 
Two I have some apples. <laughs> oh! We nearly Ooh. missed that. Going for some cheeky stuff there. Oh my lord. It's so scary to see a Craig just hold an F. <laughs> wow, nice drag down combos though. The drag it down. Yeah. Swansea is a very aware player. He's oh, totally. He's, He's thinking the whole game. Yeah. Incredibly, pres incredibly present in the game. Mm. So, if you start charging those smashes in his face, he's just going to avoid it. Oh, yeah. Oh, but actually, you know, Hamas does a good job to take that second stock. Let, let's hope he can close out this last one. Get Christchurch some pressure. Third stock, Hamish is a different beast. Yeah. <laughs> he's always, in every game, I feel like he always does that. Wow. Good DI. Great Ooh, DI. Fantastic watch DI. Out for the, watch out for the, the lightning. Oh. Well, Wellington will be happy with that. Sky, the last one remaining. Uh, who does he play? Uh, here's a Zetterburn. Ooh, he's a, nasty, nasty. He's, he's a very, uh, well, you'll find out. <laughs> yeah, no, I think I think Zetterburn's the type of character that, like, you know, Swanji could very easily in the start of this game get comboed, get lit on fire, and then just get F smashed at, like, 60 and die, yeah, you know? Yeah. It's the clash. Sky, the... um, uh, go on. Yeah, I, and it's super cool that he uh, got to come here, you know? Yep, uh, Sky's first major. Yeah. At the, at the, uh, yeah, fresh young age of 15. Yeah, I was telling Hamish before, uh, this guy's sort of like a bit of a presence. We've lost the... Oh no, we're back. Uh, this guy's the sort of guy, you know, we see him a lot on the Discord. Um, but like, you know, no one outside of Christchurch has met this guy. Just a couple of uh, adjustments we're having. Yeah. Oh, and that, like, the graphical, like, fluff, the, the, the border, I, uh, I've been told there's an old version of the, the overlay on Tokyo Tomorrow, uh, all the bugs will be sorted out. But fantastic, I love the background, it's super cool. Yeah, is that the, um, is that the same graphics on the hoodie? Yeah, yeah, that's the, uh, the biggie graphic, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just sort of panning over. Right it's sick. I don't really know a lot about stage selection when it comes to rivals. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I know I, what I like. <laughs> I think that's pretty much where everyone's at at this point. Yeah. Um, people just ban the stages they don't like. Yeah, and pick they the ones they like. Go to a stage where they can kill yeah. earliest. So All not right. too surprising this guy would go here. He wants those up smash kills. Yeah. And four air strings off the side. Very small stage in terms of blast zones. Nice movement from Sky. All right, final play of Christchurch here. Yeah, Let's see what he can do. Surprising to see um, Swanji not start out with an F kill. This is sort of like the <laughs> absolute classic, I feel. Um, but wow, nice little strings. I think the the inexperience with this matchup is really coming through here. Yeah, and I mean, yeah, like you said before, Crash not a huge amount of experience with Absa. And wow, not the best DI in the world. Yeah, no. But even so, I'm not sure if he had much of a chance to live. Wow. Feels like Opsa gets to go wherever he wants, eh? I think a, I think a fire up smash would kill here. Oh, totally. Up's a super light. A nice little combo there from Swanji. Sky, ooh. The case probably, probably wanted a hit ball there. Yeah. Sky just seems to struggle to, to get a little presence here. He's sort of got center stage now. Swanji trying to get it. Wonder if he knows about the cloud. Yeah, I sort of like that um, this guy's taking time to sort of slow down the game a little bit here. Um, yeah, whole scene of stage. Yeah. I think a lot of people get overwhelmed by Absa and just decide, oh, I'll just rush in and they get no space, but they don't really think about it. Oh, ooh, nice fantastic. Up. Yeah. Only loses one stock, but uh, is a matchup. Is a matchup, like we said, that uh, Crash is not super familiar with, so it's good to get it out of there. And now we've got Alistair. Oh, sitting in Alistair? Yeah, I'm not quite sure who he plays in this game. I believe he plays Claren. Oh, interesting. Uh, no, uh, two to four. Oh, no, sorry, two to six. Yeah. Gotta say, the music in this game is so good. Absolutely slap. So good. It reminds me of, uh, like, playing DM and people putting their, like, custom tracks on. And, like, you know, because they were not exactly, like, uh, Ethically, <laughs> ethically uh, sourced tracks, uh, they always slap. <laughs> Whereas, like, play Smash Ultimate, you go to, like, town and city, and you're like, okay, me, my Like, I love <laughs> some KG Slider, but 
Uh, yeah. we, we, we've seen your actual four. Yeah, out. exactly. If we can ascend higher on the hype plane, I reckon, yeah. than KK Slider. Oh, Claren, hell yeah. I'm always interested to see Claren players. Because I feel like um, a lot of the time when you see a Claren, they're just like a Marth main from like old, uh, from yeah, yeah. Melee or something. Just a few of those. Yeah. Some people treat it like a one-to-one kind of... Yeah, but I feel like Claren's like really different, at least yeah. from what I've played of her. She's got some wonky hitboxes. Yeah, definitely. Um, and the down B, super good, cool, oh, yeah, I yeah. think. There was a patch a month or two ago that made it so that if you land the counter off stage, you get your jump back. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> That's sick. Let's see what Alistair can do. Uh, hopefully, it's a matchup for uh, Sky that he's a little more familiar with. And, uh, you know... For Christchurch, it'd be one hell of a comeback. Yes. Let's put it like that. I believe, I believe. Yeah, it would I be a good start for Sky on his first major, for sure. I feel like we're going to see some more Sky's um, as a edge guarding that only Christchurch people know about here. Uh oh. So the character is a bit more vulnerable on wow. stage than Claren. Super good coverage of mid stage from Alistair, for sure. So Sky finds an in. Nice, nice carry. Oh, Guy not combo. Yeah, he, he doesn't tend to just pop out those if smashes like a lot of Zeta Brands do. Yeah, I feel like that's sort of the classic, and everyone gets parried oh. for it. Wow, that was so weird. Okay, good DI. I never know which way to DI that move. Yeah, right. But see, Sky's got it unlocked. Ooh. Oh, there was the Deckers. Yeah. Makes it back, but Sky's still uh, definitely got a lot more presence in this. Wow, good temper. All right. All right. And uh, Christchurch on their last stock. Sky gonna have to make a hell of a comeback at this point. Let's see if he can do it. That's, That's the start. He can definitely take these two stocks to at least take totally. the final match. Yeah, I think Zedaburn's definitely the character to do it. Super nice combo. combo. Yeah, gets the up smash but a little too early. Uh oh, caught on the platform. Get down. Oh, wow, oh, he's wobbling him. Ring. He's wobbling him in his favorite game. <laughs> you hate to see it. We're we gonna see his shine down here. Yeah, good coverage of the jump with the fireball. Ooh, good DI. Nice DI, yeah. Really good fucking. Uh, good kick chase. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Not sure exactly what he wanted there. But yeah, he just get it. Sky can still that's take dead. this. Yeah, that's death. Claren not one to make that back. Let's go, Sky! And you know, if uh, if Sky gets this one, he gets this he gets this stock back. Oh, nice! Oh, the, the shine combo. He's doing a lot better at dodging the Claren's uh, like large hip hop. He's found his footing here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he's warmed up. No pun intended. <laughs> Ooh, risky, I think, with the slam. Ooh. But. Ooh. Oh, that's it! Yeah, that's no, it! Oh, no, he's back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good air dodge. Oh, but this could still be it. This guy apparently legendary with the edge guards. Oh! Okay, he DI's yeah. it. Not good the, DI. Not the best DI, but it's, it'll do. Yeah, enough to make it. Oh! Oh, nice! Oh, that's Ooh, it! That's it! And Sky has a chance! Really good showing. On the back ropes, for sure. This is this guy that Christchurch knows and loves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now Wellington... Uh, well, sending out. From what I understand, yeah. it's our best player. Yeah. Uh, and everyone sort of gets how Edelus could be pretty frustrating <laughs> to play again. Everyone thinks they know Edelus. Yeah. And then they play a different Edelus, and they're like, oh, never mind. I know that guy's Edelus. <laughs> I was kind of hoping I would get a go with this Edelus. Yeah. Much, not gonna lie. You're pretty confident in the matchup. I, I just like comboing heavies. No, that's and fair. I used to play Edelus myself, so I kind of know the character. Ah, uh, totally, totally. That's not how it played out, and here we are. Sky, Sky actually had a chance. Yeah. I mean, and it would be damn impressive to get him. Uh, and you know, he gets the combo heavy on this game. Yeah. It could, it could just happen. Uh, I believe in that boy. Ooh, music selection, big choice. Uh, stages here, I think. Hmm. I do think, yeah. Hmm. I, I sometimes I think, <laughs> not often, but uh, just when it counts. Yeah. Oh, is he gonna go? If I don't know about that. Yeah. 
I think FD could be really rough. I, I, oh, I feel like Idolus is going to get a lot of ice play here. Yeah. And he's going to be able to abuse it the entire game too. Instead of, but, um, you know, Sky probably the kind of, I think he definitely is the kind of player who just goes into training mode onto FD and just totally combos the pick out of those heavy AIs. Let's go. Start right. of the final, final, final game, yeah. Uh, ooh, already strong well. showing, yeah, from Sky. Uh, I think this is definitely the disadvantage that Eggtime has is the Sky's warm. Yeah. Sky's hot. Coming in real. Ooh. I, actually, the first person I, have, I see to abuse those high ice tools that uh, yeah, yeah. Eggtime likes to do on uh, on recovery. Uh oh. He's in the he's in the he's in the Edelish mix. Uh oh. Good ice cool. Nice to use for the down tilt. And this could be rough. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's gone. Yeah. Really good edge guard from Wellington. And uh, Egg Time cleans it out. There you have it, folks. Yeah. What do you think? Do you think that was like a, a matchup sort of discrepancy? Like, do you think on a different day, uh, matched up with different people? Potentially, yeah. yeah? I'm, I'm not sure how much um, Rivals Ash has been playing recently, to be honest. Mm. No, that's fair. We were talking, uh, me and IDK were talking before, and we reckon, you know, if there was a place to, like, level up your rivals, Auckland would probably be a good place to do it, but if he's not been playing, then I guess he can't do that. Yeah. Yep. Mm. But still. Cool. Yep. Nice showing from Wellington. Yeah. Um, this guy's sort of carrying the team there a little bit. <laughs> hey, hey, but I think the thing that I'm most excited about is a nice showing of characters. I think, what, was that? Eight unique characters? That was eight characters. Eight unique uh, characters? Oh, no, we had two cranks, so seven two characters. Two yeah, 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 but, I mean, <sighs> seven <laughs> unique characters, sure. Well, yeah. Good, good warm-up for tomorrow's bracket. Definitely, and a good sort of showcase of uh, yeah. what the two regions see as their, their sort of best players, you know? Yeah. Mm. But, uh, I think we might as well be moving on. Uh, Are we streaming doubles over here? Uh, I think we might be streaming a little bit of doubles, but... Uh, yeah, we're a little late on the schedule at this point. Yeah. <laughs> Classic. Uh, FGC time. Yeah. FGC time for sure. Well, I might go and find my doubles partner. Nah, totally. See what's happening. Good talking to you, Chief. Yeah, you too, man. Nice job in the commentary. Thanks. Yeah. Uh, congrats to Wellington. Uh, and uh, I think I'll be hitting out too. Uh, thanks to everyone who's uh, turned up. I'm not sure if anyone's in the chat. Uh, but. Uh, but, uh, yeah, doubles might happen. Oh, no, I've just been confirmed that uh, doubles is happening. Uh, we'll probably just have to swap around some stuff, and, um, yeah, hopefully uh, we'll have some entertaining games there, too. Uh, tune in for more, I think. We're doing, gonna do more rivals tomorrow. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure that we're at least doing top eight on stream uh, for singles on rivals. But, um, yeah, have a good night. Uh, hopefully enjoy ulti-doubles, and uh, see you around.